It's winter now, and everything seems to be on hold. But actually, a lot of things are happening quietly. Evergreens are the more obvious ones. As all the deciduous plants have gone into sleep mode, the evergreens are still actively seeking water through their roots. That's why they look pretty all year round, such as these rhododendrons and Pieris japonicus. They're quietly developing these buds. By the way. This process takes nutrients, so I'm gonna fertilize them a little bit. Just a little bit, because nature already does it pretty well. With that, they will look amazing in early spring, just like last year. The sedums are turning red because the pigment helps protect them from the cold. By the way, this is my bold experiment with sedum garter gardening to see if it is a practical way to decorate chain link fences. They've done really well so far, but I want to complete this one year experiment before I draw any conclusions. I can't wait to share the results with you in the spring. Also, don't forget about winter blooms. Look at this. In contrast, the deciduous plants indeed look lifeless at this time such as this field of roses, peonies, and hydrangeas. But they're also doing their things, quietly storing energy in the roots to make a splash in the next life cycle. To me personally, that's even more interesting because I enjoy things with a desolate undertone, but a hint of warmth. This sedum is like growing back into its baby form. Isn't this adorable? And doesn't this look like a winter forest? Nature is harsh, but it also harbors tender intent. The freezing cold has been throwing eyes at these plants, but now, this cap of ice is protecting them from even colder air. That's how nature rewards resilience. <laughs>